Sandy from Balloon Utopia and Market with Balloons. And today I have a really special guest. This is Dakota Page from Deluxe Balloon Company, right? Hi, everybody. I yes. got it right. Yay. <laughs> I've been messing up her company name all day, and I feel so bad because she is the most awesome person in the world and has come here to help me out. But even better than that, she is going to teach you guys how to photograph your balloons for social media. But photographing your balloons can be a challenge because we're going from three dimensions to two dimensions and it doesn't always translate. So Dakota is going to teach us how to do it well. Hi Take everybody. Away. Thank you. Uh, we're going to talk today about how to photograph your balloons for social media. And I have a few tips and tricks that can uh, help you get the perfect balloon, whether you're selling for your business or if it's just a family event and you just wanna take a better photo. So the few key elements that I like to talk about are the lighting, the camera setting, and the background. So first of all, once you leave your shop or your home and you have your beautiful balloon creation, uh, you're going to want to take your balloons uh, make sure that they're symmetrical and that the bouquet or centerpiece or whatever you're doing is facing forward and everything looks good, the colors are good. You might w even want to step back and take another photo and um, check for any color variations. And once your balloons are perfect, then we're going to talk about lighting. So I personally like outdoor lighting because it's free and there's plenty of it. So. I tend to photograph a lot of my balloons outdoors in my backyard. The problem with that is the wind. So trying to wrangle balloons is like herding cats. They blow everywhere and then your pictures come out crazy. You got one down, one in your face. So the best time to photograph balloons is between 6 and 8 a.m. So if you're up by then, you can get up early, make your bouquets, get them ready for your orders, and get your good photographs in outdoor with plenty full light. So, that's one trick. If you do not have a backyard or you live in an apartment, you can always um, use natural light that comes through uh, the window. Or um, I use these clamp lights that you can buy at any um, local store like hardware or um, a bigger chain store. And you can clamp them to either your molding or uh, wherever you might take a picture. I tend to take pictures in front of my laundry room door uh, sometimes I take pictures in front of um, my hallway door, like going outside. I've even taken them in the bathroom with a shower curtain. So once you get the lighting all set up for your balloons, then we're going to talk about your cell phones. By now, most of us are using our cell phones for our businesses and, um, you know, to try and take good photos for your family events too. So the first thing you're going to do is go into your camera settings. It doesn't matter what phone it is, they all have modes. On an iPhone, you have photo, square, pano. So what I like to do is I pick square. And if you can see, it's already pre-set up for um, your photograph and your balloons to be edited. So there's no um, cropping later, there's no squishing the photo or the balloons. Uh, and you can usually get a pretty good photo using Square, and then it's all set up for Instagram, Facebook, Snapchat, Twitter, whatever you're doing. It's a big time saver, and you can just use the one photo for all your platforms. So once you have your setting, your lighting, then let's talk about the background. Like I explained before, I use my laundry room, I'll use my front door, I even use a tablecloth, and you can get these clamps at any hardware store, and I like clamp it to my window or wherever, and then I have a perfect backdrop. So those are a few tips and tricks that can help your uh, photographs, whether you're selling for social media or for a family event. So that's my tips for the day and thank you very much. So for more tips and tricks, if you'd like to check out our page on Instagram, it's the Deluxe Balloon Company.